You know, the privilege of, of serving through the Virginia G. Piper Charitable Trust, serving nonprofits as partners, as supporters, as cheerleaders, as, as a megaphone for the issues that public needs to know about, is a joy every single day. My husband has been an incredible, incredible supporter. I think he, he did more shared parenting as our boys were growing up than anybody I know. He can change a diaper faster than any, anybody I know. Uh, so as far as, as juggling the personal and the professional, um, he has been right there every step of the way. Judy is very compassionate. Uh, she likes to help people. Uh, she was a great mother, even that I think uh, she thinks that I contributed a lot, but uh, it was her that, uh, uh, you know, they are where they are today. Both of our sons are, are involved in their community. We have a, a custom with our oldest grandchild, who is now five, and starting out when he was three, we gave him a birthday gift. But we also gave him money that he could, not a lot, just, just some, that he could choose what organization he wanted to give it to. So if he wanted to give it to the ele to, for elephant food at the zoo, or if he wanted to give it to the firefighters, he could choose what, what he wanted to do. And what we were trying to say, and what we try to say is, you may get a gift, but you need to give a gift too. I know she's a gift to me. My family had, I think, a sense that we're on this earth to serve. Um, both of my grandmothers very much had that belief. They weren't wealthy and they weren't, you know, powerful, but they believed you're here to, to help. I'm very appreciative. Uh, I will wear my Mom of the Year um, tag with great pride. It's a, a great, um, I think, range of women who are doing amazing things in this community and I'm just grateful to be part of it.